Yo, whatever, everybody. Cardboard Moses, which you welcome. Time to do another break. Uh, we're gonna be doing 2018 score football, a half case, half case number one, out of a fresh case. All right, so let's open it up. We're doing a half case here, which means we're doing six boxes. Pick the top the top six boxes here. Thank God that there's not that many packs per box in this stuff. Ten packs per box, forty cards per pack. So we're looking at four hundred cards per box, but only ten packs per box. So that's not too bad. This break. All right. Just gonna open everything up at once here. Damn, Edgar! I don't even want to know how long ago that was. Uh, what up, D. Greg? Uh, after this, I have Unparalleled Football, which is an eBay break as well. Are you looking for anything in particular, D. Craig? Uh, yes, uh, what I do, what I have are eBay breaks, uh, which are already full, which is what I'm doing right now. But uh, if you're interested, D. Craig, check out our website, ripcitycards.com. If you like what you see, register for an account and uh, save yourself fifteen dollars on your first purchase. Uh, first purchase. Yeah, I do have. I don't have any hockey or UFC stuff, uh, but I do have some hockey stuff. I have Leaf Metal Draft Hockey. I'm sorry, Leaf Metal Football. Um, I have Elite Draft Football, and I have personal boxes of Score Football, which I'm doing right now. So check out our website. If you like what you see, like I said, register for an account. And uh, we'll automatically email you a $15 off discount code, which you can use to save you some moolah. Save exactly $15 on your first website purchase. And like I said, I can't stress this enough, but you can only use that code on our website. You cannot use it on our eBay version. The reason I stress it is because I can't tell you how many times people ask me, can I use the code for eBay? No, you cannot. No. It's bad enough that you can dictate the price. But you also want a discount on top of that? Yeah, no. No, I'm not going to have this. Now is the pack opening session of the break. Which well, should be relatively quick. We only got to open, uh, what is it, 60 packs? It's not that bad. Because the packs are super duper fat. Look at that, man. Alrighty. 
professional pack stacker. Right her. These are fat packs for sure. I mean, yeah, for, uh, at this point, yes, Edgar, but I mean, it, it gets, it's, you, you see enough of the same thing after a while, you're going to get tired of it. So at least this way, you know, I get to switch it up, you know what I mean, and do a different, a different sport, different product, you know, keeps the mind active, because if I kept doing the same break over and over and, you know, the same product, the same sport, I would just, pro I would probably be sleeping right now. Drooling all over the Rip uh, the Rip City logo, and that would be no way, no. I I did a little World Cup soccer. Uh, I did personal boxes of it earlier today. And yeah, there's a good amount of packs in it, but nowhere near as bad as Donner's basketball. Or like Heritage Baseball. Or Donner's Baseball for that matter. Holy crap. Those, those fucking suck. Unfortunately, no, Edgar. I did it. Nothing cool. And one auto per box, man. That kind of that kind of sucks. Yep, looks like I won't be getting, uh, won't be leaving here anytime soon. It's almost four of them, or about to be four. Another, uh, 12, 14 hour shift in the office. Yay. Living the dream. But you know what, though? I'd rather do this shit than work for some fucking ungrateful motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? 
At least this way I'm my own boss. Do you know there's something to be said about that? And I get to hang out with you bitches. Living the dream, baby. A fucking vampire for sure, bro. That's pretty much what I mean. I sleep all I'll sleep all day. You know, I'll probably wake up around two or three o'clock. You know, get my shit together. Blah blah blah. You'll take a shower. Blah blah blah. You know what I mean? Get to the office around four, maybe four thirty, five o'clock. You know, responding to messages. You know what I mean? Doing the social media deal. Blah, blah, blah. You know, filling up the store, which sometimes Jason does for me. You know, because since I work overnight, he's sometimes in the office during the day. So it definitely helps to have a partner. You know, because he picks up my slack and I pick up his. You know what I mean? Um, but definitely, definitely a vampire, for sure. I'm about to grow fangs any day now. Let's see what we got. I got all the packs open. Here we go. Good luck, y'all. Let's see what we got here. We have an autograph for Austin Proel. I think that's how you pronounce that. I'm not sure if he got drafted or not. Because the NFL draft is officially over. Nice, simple design. I hate the watch. I'm going to turn it over. Right side up. And then that happens. God, I hate whoever packed this. Number to six, Mike Williams Chargers. That's nice. So there's no point in me flipping it back and forth. But I'm going to do it anyway. To 35, Darius Geis. He fell all the way to the second round, I believe. I forgot who picked him up, though. I think the Bucks may have picked him up. I don't remember. God, I hate this. Why can't they just put the cards facing one direction? Seriously. I feel like they do that on purpose. To hit, you know, for the breakers. Like, oh, fuck these guys. Just do everything randomly. Simple cards, but not bad at all. Not bad. Personally, I like, I like simple cards. I like simple designs. I'm not even going to bother putting them all in one direction. I think it's four autos per box in this.
Ronald Jones to 35. The autograph. I'm pretty sure he got drafted. I just don't know by who. So, boom, there it is. To six, we got Jalen Richard of the Raiders. Michael Gallup, autograph out of Colorado State. Not sure if he got drafted or not, but there you go. I wonder how CBJ did this thing. I don't even have the report, so I don't even know how he did this. Did he do it by college? Is this a player break? I don't know. You know, my partner handles all our eBay listings. I just break it. And give you a pretty face to look and bitch at. And curse at and whatnot. It's your fault, bro. Fuck you. Yep, you're right. Deshaun Hand. I know for a fact he got drafted. Again, just don't know who by who. I know, like, most of the first rounders, I think. I want to say I, I do, but I really don't. Uh, the autos are, I believe, only rookies in this set. I don't think there's any veteran autographs in this. Number 220. Reggie Ragland, Chiefs. And that's one box down. Let's keep it going. Terrell Pryor Sr. to 35. Redskins. Is Rudolph Mason any good? The name sounds familiar. Is that a dude from Florida State? That name sounds familiar. Marcus Allen, safety out of Penn State. The autograph. I'm trying to remember, but nothing, nothing comes to mind right now, Edgar. So, honestly, I don't know if he's any good or not. Mason Rudolph from Tennessee does not ring a bell. Is that is that a player you guys drafted or something, uh, Edgar? 
to 50 Raheem Green for the Trojans. So far, only one auto in the box. Where the others at? Let's get some first rounders or something. Here we go. Tremaine Edmonds. One of one, baby. That's nice. That's nice. Forgot who drafted him, but he is a first round draft pick, I believe. If I'm not mistaken. I could be, but I doubt it. I could be, but I doubt it. We have Michael Gallup to 50. Well, it is that time of year, Edgar. You know, you want to try to sell it if you can so people, you know, get a little crazy with their pricing. To 50, Jared Cook, Raiders. Mason Rudolph. Oh, that's right. He is an Oklahoma State quarterback. Now that you mention it, yes, he is. My man got the Google skills on dick. Or he just got that knowledge. I'm going to go with he got that knowledge. Leighton Vander Esch. I know for a fact this guy is a first round draft pick. What team? I don't know. Boom. There you go, my boy Big Greg knows his stuff. There you go, my man. So the Vander Esch goes to the Cowboys. Tremaine Edmonds, do you remember what team he went to? That's another big linebacker. I just can't remember what team he went to. Uh, Quadre Henderson, autograph out of uh, Pittsburgh. I'm not sure who he got drafted by either. He might have gone undrafted, I'm not sure. Big Greg knows his shit, man. My boy Mark Walton got drafted to the Bengals. <coughs> and uh, a friend of mine that I went to uh, that I went to high school with, I've actually known him since the eighth grade, so I've I'm, I'm known him for a while. Uh, he actually is the uh, the DB's coach at the University of Miami. So I got to see like you know vi you know he he records stuff uh, behind the scenes. So you know he records some practices uh, over at with the Hurricanes or you know little events here and there. He can't do much, but you know he does show the homies a little inside uh, view of what goes on in college football and things like that. Um, so he was he actually showed Mark Walton's reaction when he got drafted by the Bengals. Because, you know, he was there. The whole Hurricane family was together. And it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool to see. Um, I really just want to get free tickets to the to the Hurricane game. But we'll, we'll get there at one point. Uh, it's a 35 Nelson Aguilar for the Eagles. Glenn C. Who went to the Bills? Tremaine Edmonds? I think that sounds right. I'm on box three. Uh, well, actually, I can't even tell you what box I'm on. 
since I opened them all at once. <laughs> it's a 35 Deshaun Hamilton. Dude, that's a big yeah, that's a big thing right there, man. Isn't uh is BSU in the in the MAC conference? Or what 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 are they? Was that Boise State? There's like a division two school or something? I think they are in the MAC conference. Dude, the MAC puts out NFL talent though. The MAC is not to be slept on. A, there are a few Hall of Famers. Some pro bowlers have come out of there. Dalton Schultz. Autograph. Boom. A little boom. A little boom. Need a big boom like a Baker. Or a Saquon. Or Sam Darnold, the third pick. I think Sam Darnold was the third pick. Been Division One for a while. Oh, what is that? The Mountain West, you said? Yes, yeah, I only watched the ACC. Hurricanes, baby. Out of Tate for Florida State. Out of Gray. Uh, no, what is it, Edgar? Saquon. Oh wait. Oh, that's the kid with the uh, without the without the hand or whatever out of UCF. Uh, I think he got drafted by the Seahawks, so he's playing with his brother, his twin brother, which is pretty pretty fucking cool. Roquan Smith. That's a good card. Autograph right there. But yeah, that's you know I'm a, I'm from Miami, Big Greg. So, you know, football is 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 I can't even understand. I can't I can't un I can't I can't tell you how big football is here in the South, especially in Miami. So, you know, it's all about the U, and we we say that seriously. Like it's all about the U. Like we just we watch the U, and we don't care what goes on anywhere else. So we're little, we're a little arrogant in that sense, but considering what we've done as a program in the short amount of time that we have been a program, I think I think we've kind of earned that right. Especially the amount of talent we've put in the league, and the amount of Hall of Famers we'll have within the next 10, 20 years. It, it would not surprise me if. We, we, I think we're going to get back to, to national championship contention real soon. Uh, as soon as this year, honestly. If Mark Walton didn't get hurt last year, who knows what we could have done. Because he was a big, big part of our offense. You scooped up a uh, SAP auto letter patch for... Ooh, damn. Where's that from? From Immaculate or something, Big Greg? What What, what product is that from? Uh, Tra Tavon Austin to 10 for the Rams. I heard he got traded. Saquon Griffin will single-handedly change the Seahawk defense. <laughs> oh, the internet, man. Internet is undefeated, boy, I tell you. Oh, you got it from Unparalleled. Twenty thirteen upper deck. Ooh, that sounds like some fanciness. 
That's in the personal collection, Big Greg. Matter of fact, what what are you a fan? What 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 teams are you a fan of, man? Uh, Sony Michelle, number to fifty. I think he got drafted by the Patriots. Sony Michelle. Patriots, I don't think they drafted a quarterback. So they're just going to clone Tom Brady or something. I don't know. Dorrance Armstrong Jr., autograph out of Kansas. I'm sure a lot of these guys have gone undrafted. Cowboys fan, but your sap is your favorite non-cowboy. I was going to say, yeah, because Warren Sap is a buccaneer. Alright. I want to say we're about halfway through this. To 50, Alex Smith, who now plays for the Redskins. Oh, dude, Warren Sapp was a beast. You don't got to tell me, man. I saw him play in college, bro. Along with those other star-studded UM teams we had back in the 90s and early 2000s. If it wasn't for that whole Shapiro scandal or whatever the hell, man, the U would probably have won a few national titles. In, you know, in the time span since that whole little fiasco happened. You know, we got caught, but everybody does it, bro. Everybody. Every, every big program in the NCAA does that shit. But because it's Miami, we, uh, I'm, just, I'm just happy we didn't get the death penalty. You know, we were really close to getting the death penalty. And just I'm just happy we still have a football program, honestly. Numbered to 20, Robbie Anderson, the Jets. I see plenty of points. 150 of them. Got a random. And I'll do that at the end of the break. Riley Ferguson, Memphis quarterback, with the auto. Jamon Moore autograph out of Mizzou.
Kurt Benkert. Quarterback from Virginia with the autograph. Man, he lit up Miami this 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 past season. I wonder if he got fucking drafted. Cause he lit us up uh when he played in Miami with Virginia. Lit us I think he lit us up for like almost four hundred yards, man. They lost, but still. Actually, I think Virginia might have beat us, actually. We, we know we had a terrible end to the season, man. We started strong, and we just we just got burned out, man. Injuries killed us. I'm curious to see what them boys are going to do this year. We had a strong recruit class. I think we can win a national championship, but we'll see. Uh, to 10, Chase Litton, quarterback from Marshall. To 50, James Conner, Steelers. Almost done, almost done. DJ Chark, who in my opinion is going to be a stud in the pros. Freak athlete who I think has insane potential at the next level. Don't know who he got drafted by, but I know for a fact he got drafted. He had to. He's a top three receiver in the nation. We have Cedric Wilson Jr. Auto to 50. Repping Boise State. Darren Carrington, the second auto for Utah. So much for six o'clock, we're looking more like seven o'clock. Chark went to the Jaguars. Oh, man. Giving, giving Blake Bortles a nice deep threat right there. And Jaguars definitely need some offensive weapons. Because that defense is solid. But their offense... Uh, I should probably think about getting another back. Uh, so Leonard Fournette doesn't get dinged up because that guy's a beast. Jerome Brown of the Cardinals, number to 50 Doug Baldwin Seahawks to 
to 50 Darius Slay Lions. I can't believe the Ravens drafted Lamar Jackson. Lamar Jackson's gonna fuck shit up with the Ravens, man. Get to learn on, under Joey Flacco for a little bit. You know, Big Greg, and not only that, man, but dude, they were they were like they were a quarter away from from the Super Bowl. You know, if, if their offense just their offense just sputtered out. More put any points to random. Yay for those. Those replace autographs. Yeah. I hate putting any points. Just give me the auto, seriously. I don't know about Blake Bortles, though. Blake Bortles, to me, is one of those. He's like Jake Cutler 2.0. When he's good, man, he's, he's not bad at all. When he's good, man. But when he's bad, oh, God. Jared Cook, Raiders to six. Number to 10, Saquon Barkley. Number two pick right there. I hope he does well with the, with the Giants. Because Penn State doesn't really produce quarterbacks. You know, Penn State is mostly known for their linebackers. Really? So Des Bryant still hasn't signed with a team? And what's his deal? He probably wants to go to a championship contending team, Big uh, Big Greg. And if that's the case, uh, I don't think the Ravens are there yet. Imagine if Des Bryant went to the Raiders. Oh, my God. That would be a maze. Josh Adams with the autograph there. Or maybe go to the Patriots. Go to the, you know what I mean. Go go to a championship contending team, or go to the Steelers. Steelers just lost Martavis Bryant. You know, they traded him in, during the draft. So, you know, if I were Des, I'm, I would be looking for championship contending teams. Or maybe go to the Panthers. Go to the Panthers, man. They they need a they need a wide receiver. Or the Patriots, like I said. Gronkowski, number to six for the Patriots. Dude, Des Bryant. Could you imagine Des Bryant and Tom Brady on the same team? That would be nasty. Leighton Vander Esch, the autograph again. I think that's the second auto there. Going to the Cowboys. I'm not even sure how CBJ did this break. Did he, did he do this thing as a team thing or college, conference? I don't even know. Anyway. What else we got? Almost done. Almost done. And we have unparalleled football after this. Or maybe, maybe go to the Packers. Des Bryant with the Packers would be nice. Aaron Rodgers? What? Vita Vea, who people are saying could be the next Haloti Nada. He is a buccaneer, if I'm not mistaken. Vita Vea. Hoping to uh, 
Walk in the footsteps of Mr. Warren Sapp. Another great defensive tackle. You know what I'm saying? Randy Moss and Brady was insane. I'm not comparing Des Bryant to Randy Moss. Because Randy Moss is, in my opinion, like one of the greatest receivers of all time. Like top five all-time greatest receiver. And Des Bryant is a great, great court, uh, receiver. But I don't know if I'd put him up there with Randy Moss. But still, a Des Bryant... Tom Brady combination would be insane. Laguerre Blount, uh, Blount to 35 for the Eagles. I wonder if the Eagles are going to repeat. Man, I can't wait for some football. I wonder what the Dolphins are going to look like. That's my team. I'm a Dolphin fan. You know, I'm forever optimistic about them. I think we did pretty good in the draft. You know, we addressed positions. We addressed pretty much every single position we were weak at. With the exception of quarterback. Which is what we needed the most. So we, we shall see what the Dolphins are looking like. Hopefully Tannehill can stay healthy. Because he's supposed to be our franchise quarterback. We shall see. We shall see. Your dad's a Dolphins fan? Awesome, Greg. Yeah, I'm uh, well, I'm, I'm from Miami, bro, so got to root for the home team. Marlins, the Heat, the Dolphins, the U. You know, I would root for the Panthers, but one, we suck, and two, you know, why do we even have a hockey team in Florida? That, like, that, does, especially Miami, like, that don't make no sense. I think I see Panini points. I do. 600 Panini points. Which we need to random. And we'll do that here coming up because we're almost done. Boom. And the last stack mojo is. Here, where we at? Number to 50, Orlando Brown, Oklahoma Sooner. Boosh. Yeah, like Vegas has a hockey team. Like, what? They're really good, too. Really good. But Vegas with a hockey team? Like, that don't make no sense. Whatever. All right, anyway, that was the break, y'all. Uh, but I do need to check on one thing. Uh, I'm not sure how this break was done. So I'm going to do a little quick little research here on our eBay listings and find out exactly how this was done. Was it done by team? The Knights are crushing it, man. Uh, uh, I saw that they, um, oh, it was done by team. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, man, an, an expansion team, and they're fucking, they're beating up on, uh, I think the, the, the Kings or the Lightning or something? Something? I don't know. I don't follow, I don't follow hockey. So, uh, what I can tell you is what I hear on ESPN. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we are doing this by teams. So, recap time. Before that, actually. Random time. We're going to go seven times in the randomizer for Panini points. So, this is how we're going to do this thing. Instead of doing three different randomizers, we're going to assign prizes. So, the first prize goes to the top spot, 600 Panini points. Spots two and three get 150 Panini points each. Got it? Good. There's the randomizer with all the teams. We're going seven times. Good luck, everyone. And the money shot seven. Seven times. So the Cardinals are going to be receiving 600 Panini points.
the Titans are getting 150 Panini points. And the Panthers, who are in third place, will also get a, uh, 150 Panini points. So Cardinals get 600, Titans and Panthers, which are spots 2 and 3, get 150 Panini points. Cool beans. Recap time. So we have autos of Vita Vea, uh, Leighton Vander Aish, Josh Adams, Darren Carrington, Cedric Wilson, DJ Chark, uh, Kurt Benkert, J. Moore, Riley Ferguson, Dorrance Armstrong, Roquan Smith, uh, Auden Tate, Dalton Schultz, Quadre Henderson, Lane Vander Aish, Trayman, uh Tremaine Edmonds, Marcus Allen, Deshaun Hand, Michael Gallup, Ronald Jones, and Austin Pro. And that was the break. 2018 score football half case number one eBay style. There it was. Thank you very much. We'll get that out.